Hello and welcome everyone to another episode of Train of Thought. I am Enigo. I will be playing with trains and giving you my thoughts. It's been five minutes for me. It's been a week for you. Funny how the internet works when you schedule videos. Um, actually, I'll be right back because I forgot something. Let's just start over. Hello and welcome everyone. Nope. Hello and welcome everyone to another episode of Train of Thought. I am Enigo and I will be playing with trains, giving you my thoughts. It's been five minutes for me. It's been a week for you. Funny how the internet works. But, um, yeah, it's, it's like that movie, uh, Interstellar. It's all relative. So new buttways actually look look what they did here with like the little trees and stuff. And also I'm getting bloody rich. That's because I talk too much and play too little so I don't spend enough money. But yeah, look at the little trees. That's so nice. And they're actually they're starting to pave over at the fish market, which is very nice. I am very pleased with that. Well pleased. Um so I noticed that there were... Oh, look, they're building over here now. That's good. I noticed that there were quite a few passengers here at um, Old Town Hall and also uh, Marfingfield South. Uh, so I, I did another train. Yeah. I also um, made this look nice. So there's like a truck area here with a little office and there's a forklift there and a little thingy here and theoretically fruit could pile up here but I don't think it's gonna happen because I have this station pretty well serviced yeah so um that's a thing today what I wanted to do is uh, are you also a plantation and you're also a plantation I am like and this is also a plantation. I am like, jeez. Oh wait, that's the same plantation I noticed before. So there's like, and I also noticed one over here. I don't know. What? How do I double production in these things? Go away, station. I don't like you. Deliver 14 crates of uh, farm supplies. I, I don't have farm supplies, so... That's not going to happen. <clears throat> I forgot what I was going to do. God damn. Uh, oh yeah. So, there's a hotel here. I honestly, I think, like, I'm not sure what's going on with this hotel. Like, structurally. Seems like two hotels stuck together. That's fine though. We can deal with that. Actually, let's pre this up a bit. We have something for that. We have little gardens that we can do. Flower bed. Here, put a flower bed there. There you go. Isn't that just much nicer? Put one there too. Yeah. Oh wait, it makes it... It names it stations. So that's a little bit of a blah. I could make a little park though. That would be fun. Maybe I'll do that next episode. Um, so because enough, enough has happened, because it's five minutes ago for me, I have prepared a list of vlog topics, of which there are two less than I need to make episodes. And today's vlog 
The topic is coding isn't magic, apparently, because that's what I wrote down. Sugar beets. Oh, that's a thing. Now, what I wanted to do today is make alcohol from Chitown. Chitown? Go down all the way to um, Sanning Hall, Central Sanning Hall. No, Sanning Hall, Old Town Hall. I think Sanning Hall really needs its own station, but I, I'll be buggered if I know how. I mean, I could do a subway, but those are just trucks. So, and I also don't think subways can do even do goods. Um, and hang on, can I see what the catchment area is? Yeah, this will not. Although this does accept alcohol, which is weird. Why do you accept alcohol? Is there a petrol station here? Disable all. Hotels. Petrol station. There is no petrol station. Well, I'll be damned. Did I do something weird here that this accepts alcohol? Well, whatever. I don't really care. I don't give a damn. So yeah, all we have to really do is um, buy another one of those trains I found. Found. If I can find it. I think it was this one. Yeah, this one's pretty good. It's like... Actually, there was a better one, wasn't there? No. There was like a 2,000 horsepower one. For like nine, this is 19, and this is also 19 now, so it doesn't really matter. Um, how much are you producing? Zero. So basically, that means you haven't produced anything in a while. 80,000 litres. How do I do that? Alcohol. Okay. We're going to get a third generation so that's how much is that alcohol how much alcohol is that tell me 49,000 litres that's a lot of booze I mean I gotta be honest with you I could drink all that in a single night that would be difficult and also kill you um, I'm just gonna do four I don't know how many I need, so I'm just going to do four. I like that it varies up the little cart thingies. That's that's interesting. I should have given this an overhaul while I was doing things. And um, we probably want to have a third rail here. But there's not enough incoming yet to justify it. Because, like, we're going to have one rail occupied with him waiting and then another one with fruit. Oh, wait, but we're also going to have passengers but the passengers can wait for the fruit truck that's fine so you want to go non-stop and non-stop okay well that was my project for the week so <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I wonder if I could do like a tour like a bay tour from New Botway to Sanningall let's do that that sounds lovely doesn't it um, how would I do that? I would have to buy build a dock. I guess here is as good a place as any. I hope it's not too close to the other one. Oh no, that oh, works fine. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So yeah, um, there's this thing where people like to pretend code is magic. And I don't like it very much because it gives people like this this feeling of it teaches them that because code is magic and not just logic, that it's not something you can learn, it's just something that you have to be good at, which I don't really, <clears throat> don't really agree with. So ideally I would want the hovercraft. 
Um, but I think I'm going to do the passenger ferry because I don't think we we will have enough passengers here to justify it. Oh shit! I'll be right back. Okay. Sorry about that. I may have dragged the screen a little bit, which is not. Wait, did this just change? This is not good. Why did all my streets change? This is not what I wanted. Why do all my streets look different? I mean, I suppose it's no big deal, but I'm pretty sure that's not what it looked like before. Hang on. No, that's not what it looked like before. Did I enter a new era or something? Is that, is that what's happened? I think it must have. Yeah, I guess so. Because they were, they were blank before. Why is there a little thingy there? I am so confused. Is it everywhere? It's everywhere. That's not really quite as nice, I think. Is that because I hit... Uh, maybe because I hit 1970. That could be it. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, um... Where did the boat go? I know I had a boat here. You can't tell me I didn't have a boat here. You can't. That's not how this works. For the love of... Let's just go find the latest boat that we made. I guess... Running Hall Manor? No. Oh. Sword by Age. Ah, oh, that's the latest one. Okay, that's fine then. I suppose. Oh uh, yeah, I was doing this, wasn't I? Yeah. So he'll just go back and forth. That's fine. Actually, if you're gonna do that, I did notice something. I think this, yeah, this takes passengers. So just go there as well. That's fine. I don't know, I zoomed out. This these roads are not as nice. They're just they're just not. They're so stripy and contrasty. Like I don't know, to me it's like the road is the most visible thing if you zoom out now. Which is not really nice. Oh like it's fine if you zoom in. Sort of. But yeah. Yeah, that's not good. So yeah, um, when I started to code, I did really don't know anything. And the only reason I'm so good at code as I am now, um, hmm, I wonder if we could leverage this somehow. This doesn't go anywhere, so that's kind of a shame. Yeah, I, d I um, didn't, didn't know how to code. And I was like 15 or something and I just started learning myself. I just started with QBasic and then I moved up to Visual Basic 6 and then eventually I moved to C and C++ and Python and C Sharp. And I'm basically the best at C Sharp at the moment. The other ones I don't use as much anymore. But I still know all of them. I wish we could... Oh, we can pretty this up, actually. So let's just do that. 
So I didn't. I want this one here. Oops, that's that's wrong. That's not what I wanted to do. And the problem when when you're like talking about code wizards and all of that kind of stuff is that people get this idea. Um, people get this idea. You know what? Well, first off, oh my god, go away. First off, this is dumb. Stop doing that. That's not a good plan. Just just build houses there. It's fine. Oh, unless it can't do a 3x3. Three three. That might be the case. Let's see if we have a 3x3 three three anywhere. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it likes three by tr three areas. So then the middle is never going to get filled up, which is kind of unfortunate. Okay, let's just do it like this then. And then you could put something here. Isn't that nice? Doesn't that make you happy? Makes me happy. Um, you know what I want to do? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, just to make a park. There's no good area to put it. And you know, I could put it here. Oh, so this is all wrong, isn't it? If this is all three by three. This is a two by two, so that's fine. Oh, and then this lines up. Oh, that's bloody marvelous. We can just pull this through here and just get a nice grid going on here. Um, and then what I think I'll do is remove this and gonna make a park here while I talk about coding and how it's not magic. If I don't put anything in the middle, will that work? I hope so. What if I just just put like three by one, two, three, four, five? Just plonk this down, see what happens. That's quite gross, that is. Um So I'm going to fill this up. Hmm. Minus land. Yeah, if you talk about coding like it's magic, it... I don't know, it's hard to articulate my thoughts on this, but it's like, it's not magic, you can learn it, it's just logic. And all that coding is, is looking at what information do I have available? What kind of behavior do I want to create using that information? I wish I had more. It's kind of unfortunate. What information do I have available and how do I use the available information to generate more information to get the behavior that I want? Um, hmm. what if I remove you and I'll put in, uh, ooh, that's new, lorry station. Wait, this is lorry station? Oh, I wanted the bus station. Weren't the lorry stations different before? Weren't they like this? Weren't they different? What the hell is going on? My road vehicle depot has also changed. That building is still the same. Yeah, I think this might just be the modernized version or something. All oh, my shit has glitched out. This is also a possibility, but I don't think so. 
I'm not sure how I feel about all of this. Okay, so I want this one. So you have like a little bus station going to the park. And then we're gonna do... I wish we had more of this, like maybe just train tiles that are just literally just trees. So put one there and put one there. Maybe put... I like this one because it's purplish. Um, put those there. Maybe get a smaller one in here. Hmm. Get a single one there. That, that, that looks nice. So we're gonna name this to uh, New Butley Park. And then we're gonna not do anything with it until people start building houses here and then they'll want to come here and do things maybe with their lives i don't know um <clears throat> wow look at all that money what time are we on oh we're still good yeah, so it's really just logical thinking, and I think that's something that should be taught in school, and programming should be taught in school to, to like demystify it, because anyone can do it. It's just the more practice you have, the easier it becomes. I need to find a new new project. What is all this? I don't know. Chart time no longer accept goods. Oh, you bastards. 14,000 litres. Oh yeah, I made an alcohol train. Did I mention I made an alcohol train? Which is currently heading for Chitown. From Chitown to... New Buckway Old Town Hall. Yeah, a lot of alcohol. How much capacity? Oh, by the time it'll get back, it's fine. They actually... Like, route it to certain... Oh, that's horrible. Um... Oh, there's no way to get from here to here by car. We should probably fix that. Let's uh, do this then. Just put a tunnel under the plantation. No, that is not what I wanted, game. Ah. God. Are you kidding me? Look, just put a rope down there. Fine. See if I care. Actually, I do quite, quite care a lot. Ah! Why are you doing this to me? This is also new. This, like, weird little ending. I'm not sure if I approve of all of these changes, of this upheaval. Maybe I just messed something up in the options, but I can't imagine what. Okay, so that's connected. Should probably connect it here as well. There we go. That's fine. Actually, we should probably polish this up a bit. Oh, we can't. Can we? Oh, we can. Oh, that's nice. Okay, fine. I take it all back. So now this is connected. <clears throat> Which is good, I suppose. We might need, like, something coming in here. I don't know. I'll let them worry about it. Uh, 
Yeah. I'm not so good at this vlogging thing, am I? Oh well. Also recording like a couple of these in like tandem is kind of exhausting. So there you go. You know what we could do here? We could um... No you don't have a car park do you? But you have a car park. I know one of you has a car park. Yeah, this looks like like just cars, but I'm gonna pretend it's a car park. So car park into the park. That's fine. Um Yeah, I don't know what I'm saying now. I'm I've lost the plot completely. But yeah, coding is a learnable skill. I will say that. Coding is a learnable skill. There is nothing magical or mystical about it. It's just applying logic. Which is not that hard. It's not that freaking hard. What is this? Aluminium plant. Yes, aluminium, not aluminum. You heard me. I don't know. I don't know what the hell to do with that. I just don't know what the hell to do with anything right now. I do want to, um... See, this is quite darling, isn't it? Just have this little island here, which has a little village on it, and then Sonberg, so maybe I'll do a bit. And we have Munfingberg Asylum, which now has a stadium! I don't know what you're doing at the asylum, but I'm not quite sure I approve. Wasn't this different before too, this hospital? Oh. It is actually quite a few little island thingies. Um, this actually, uh, no. Fund new industries? Wasn't there an option somewhere to fund a town? See if we have no, still no subsidies. I guess that's broken. I thought I had an option to fund a town. I thought I did. I really thought, but apparently I didn't. Or is this it? What is this? What are you? Nope. Oh, I can't find it. I'll look for it some other time. I think it's about time that mm, we build an airport. Although, to build an airport, we're going to need to find another hub area that we're going to... that was the wrong key. That we're going to build up. So let's do that. Let's um, take a look at the city directory. Town directory, whatever. Sort by... no, the other way around, thank you. Let's see. Baffingly Market is apparently... No, this isn't sorted by... this is sorted by name. Okay, that's not what I wanted at all. Thank you. Okay, new botway is obviously the biggest. Who is Little Winston? Apparently it's like Farming Central here. It's like Eddingwood and Fending Hall and Drunningstone and New Binding Stone. There's quite a lot of shit here. Is that sufficiently far away from New Butway? It looks like it is very, very far away from New Butway. So we could do this one. Or we could go to Banning... No, this doesn't look good. Tenfington? No. Flutting well. Let's see if Little Winston, you're probably a city, aren't you? Yeah, you're a city. Okay, you've been chosen. This is a great honour. But... I think that's actually all the time we have today. I didn't get anything done. I didn't do any good vlogging. I'm basically a terrible person. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye!